Vasily Vladimirovich Dolgorukov. Prince Vasily Vladimirovich Dolgorukov, Russian. C. January 1667, February 11, 1746, St. Petersburg, was a Russian commander and politician. Promoted to field marshal, in 1728. His life and fortune swung like a weather vane, due to complex plots and the troubled time following Peter the Great's death. Life Son of a boyar, Vasily Dolgorukov was, starting from 1685, a stolnik at the royal court. He was then enlisted in the Preobrazhensky Regiment in 1700, starting his true military career. Serving in the Preobrazhensky Regiment, he took part in Russian Northern Wars and distinguished himself during the Siege of Matava in 1705. In 1706, he was transferred to Ukraine, where he was under the command of Ivan Mazepa, where he distinguished himself in 1707 to 1708 during the squelching of the Bulovin Rebellion. During the Battle of Poltava he was the commander of the Reserve Cavalry Force. In 1715, he was sent to Poland as a representative of Peter, who was ill at that. IME, where he concluded, in 1716, a pact with Danzig, forcing the city into an anti-Swedish policy. He also accompanied Peter the Great during his foreign travels in 1717 and 1718. Despite being a favorite of Peter the Great, Dolgorukov disapproved a number of Peter's reforms and eventually became a partisan of Tsarevich Alexei Petrovich. In 1718, following Alexei's trial and death, Dolgorukov reproached Peter such a violent behavior towards his own son. Dolgorukov was tried, demoted, and exiled to Solokomsk. Following Catherine I's coronation on May 7, 1724, Dolgorukov was brought back from his exile and given the rank of colonel and then brigadier. In 1726, he was appointed commander-in-chief of Caucasus forces. In 1728, as an ultimate consecration of his military career, he was promoted field. Marshal and member of the Supreme Privy Council. After Anna Ioannovna's coronation in 1730, Dolgorukov was appointed to Senate and made President of College of War. However, reportedly made insulting remarks regarding persecutions staged by Anna against his family. In 1731, after a complex plot, he was accused of insulting remarks regarding the Empress and sentenced to death. His sentence was changed to life. Imprisonment first in Schlüsselburg Fortress, then in Ivangorod in 1737, and finally he was exiled for. Life to the Solovetsky Monastery in 1739. In December 1741, following Elizabeth's coronation, Dorgorukov was brought back from his exile and fully rehabilitated. Elizabeth named him president of the College of War, a rank that he assumed until his death. While serving in the War College, Dolgorukov made significant improvements regarding the organization and logistics of Russian military. In 